Recently I've been getting quite into retro gaming and one system that I want to take a good look at is the original PlayStation. So that got me wondering, can the Pinebook Pro run PlayStation 1 games? Well, in today's video we're going to find out right now on the Linux Lounge. So before I start today's video, first I just want to say the operating system on my Pinebook Pro is Manjaro ARM, which luckily enough has the awesome RetroArch emulator in its repositories. It also has the PCSX rearmed core in its repositories, and although I did have a few minor issues installing these packages, once they were installed they both seemed to work absolutely fine and I was ready to play some PS1 games on my Pinebook Pro. First, I decided to start simple and run a 2D game, Rayman, and sure enough, I found that the game works absolutely fine and I was able to play it perfectly. The only issue that I found is that recording the screen seemed to really hurt performance for some reason, more so than in previous tests I've done on the Pinebook Pro. So, although I don't normally do this, I decided to simply record the Pinebook Pro screen for the following games, so you can get a better idea of what performance is really like. Next, I decided to try a 3D platformer, Croc. Now this game is definitely one of the less demanding PlayStation games, but I still think that it looks great visually, although that's really the only bit of this game that's aged remotely well. Anyways though, I digress. The game runs great on the Pinebook Pro and looks absolutely fantastic on the Pinebook Pro screen. Next, I decided to try a 3D racing game, and for that I went with the original Ridge Racer. And sure enough, just like Croc, this game works perfectly too. Galaga minigame and all. So if you're looking for a 3D arcade style racing game for your Pinebook Pro, maybe give Ridge Racer a go through RetroArch. Next, I decided to try out one of my personal favourites, Crash Bandicoot, and sure enough, this game works absolutely perfectly and looks brilliant on the Pinebook Pro screen. So I've got to say, I am very impressed that you can run one of the best platforming games ever made right here on the Pinebook Pro. Finally, I decided to try out Crash Bandicoot 3 Warped. Without a doubt, this is one of the most visually impressive games on the PS1, and sure enough, it works great here emulated on the Pinebook Pro. My only complaint would be, is that to my eyes, it looks like the game isn't running necessarily as smoothly as it should be at times, but I think it might be that way on real PS1 hardware as well, and even then, I would really have to be nitpicking to notice. This game is completely playable here on the Pinebook Pro. And with that said, those are all the games that I tested. I have to say, I'm absolutely blown away that emulation works this well on the Pinebook Pro. So I'll reiterate what I've always said here. The Pinebook Pro is absolutely as far away from a gaming laptop as you could possibly get. But that's definitely not to say that you can't play a few casual retro or open source games on it, because you absolutely can and you can have a great experience doing so. But with that said, that's it for today's video, I thank you for watching it and I will see you in the next one.